Hello guys, welcome back to my channel, welcome back to a new video, a new gameplay. Today I'm bringing you guys top 10 tips for state of survival game. It's a new game that I started playing recently and uh, well I've been playing for a few months now and I noticed that there are a lot of things that I didn't do when I started the game and that is why I want to make this video. I hope you start playing this game, it's an amazing game. And I will tell you guys a few tips in this video. So before we start, I request you guys to make sure you watch the complete video. And only ask me questions after you have watched the video completely in the comments down below. And I will be more than happy to answer all your questions. Starting with tip number one, the basic. This is a game of team play. This is not the game of solo games. So as soon as you start playing this game, within a day or two, try to join in any alliance because there are a lot of benefits of joining the alliance the one of the basic benefit is it's better to be in a team than to be a solo because if you're solo many other teams will eat you alive from all directions but if you are a part of a team they will be very very afraid to attack you now tip number two is all about your intention do you want to grow in this game faster do you want to upgrade your headquarter levels the hero precinct and all the other buildings in your settlement do you want to grow them quickly or do you want to take your time so if you play for free you'll be able to grow your alliance or, or sorry your settlement but it will take a lot of time but if you want to grow them fast usually the state of survival team gives you some early crazy offers so you spend a little bit of money it's very very simple you want to grow faster you start paying you want to grow slowly you keep growing slowly for free tip number three is again basic which i did not do it and that's why i want to add this in the list is you keep asking questions if you don't know something if you haven't researched it on google or if you haven't watched videos on youtube of how to do certain things in the game you ask questions in both your state chat and your alliance chat in your alliance chat your alliance teammates will help you out and in the state chat every single person in your state regardless of whatever the state is they will be able to see your message if they are online and they will be able to help you out tip number four is related to alliance so if you join any alliance try to see their timing uh, what time they have a trap or what time they have certain events you will usually find them in the notification or in the logs or you can ask the top players in that alliance try to grow yourself and try to join bigger alliance as quickly as possible don't just stay in one alliance from the beginning if you are headquarter level 2 level 3 you might join a small alliance but as soon as you start growing like level 20 level 25 something like that you will need to join bigger alliance Tip number five is, like I said, if you don't want to pay for early offers, you want to grow slowly, so utilize your overnight time. If you're going to sleep, make sure your troops are out there gathering resources for you while you enjoy a good night's sleep. Your troops are here at your disposal. They will do exactly what they want, what you want them to do. So better send them out gathering resources overnight. Tip number six is, manage your stamina carefully try to complete all intel missions every single day they will give you a lot of help and they will give you a lot of resources tip number six also involves team management or alliance management immediately when you start a construction you can ask help from team members and you can also give them help and that will give you alliance resources and alliance points to buy from the alliance store you can buy lots of items for daily usage from the alliance store with that help tip number eight is similar to tip number five which is utilization of resources so try to build 24 7 like train your troops or upgrade your troops as you keep upgrading your headquarter level so the more you upgrade or train your troops the more the battle power you will have and the more defense you will be able to handle when someone attacks you one other way to gather resources quickly is to use your alliance hero support and do the explore missions you can find explore missions 
from the settings of Hero Precinct. The bigger the alliance is, the more chances you have of finding a very powerful hero to use in the Explore Challenge. And the tip number 10, the last tip for this video is try to manage your resources carefully because if you are starting a construction of a building or starting the training of your troops, you will need sufficient resources. So make sure you have sufficient resources before you start the construction. So these are the 10 basic tips which I believe everyone should know and unfortunately some of these tips I had no idea and I didn't do any research. I just kept on going with the flow and learning by making mistake or learning by the help of my alliance members or from the state chat and all that stuff. Don't forget to hit the like if you enjoyed this video. Make sure you subscribe to my channel so you get the notification of my new videos right away. Drop a comment down below, let me know and I'll be more than happy to answer all your questions. Take care guys, have a nice day, stay safe, stay home and survive. Peace out.